welcome back to the Almost Daily Dennis YouTube channel. I have Lou with me and we're going to make another fun for kids recipe. The first one we made was the St. Patty's Trail Mix and today we're making taco dippers. Taco dippers. So what we have here is some of the Pillsbury pizza dough that we have taken a pizza cutter and cut into smaller rectangles. So taco dippers are a taco inside of the dough. All right, so inside of our smaller pizza dough, I have pre-cooked some ground beef with taco seasoning, so that's been cooked since yesterday. And then I'm going to, I'm going to put the ground beef in, and then I'm going to allow Luna Bell to sprinkle some cheese on top. And then once we get them all rolled up, we have melted some butter with some taco seasoning in there, and we're gonna use that to brush on top. You ready? Yeah. All right, so what I'm going to do, Lou, is pour this in there, and then I can pour the cheese in, and then we can put the taco seasoning on. Yeah, thank you. Okay. I think she knows what we're doing. So I'm trying to stay away from these edges a little bit because we're going to have to tuck those in. So I'm just putting like a little log in the center. And, and, and now can you sprinkle some of this cheddar and, cheese on here? And the kids can probably eat some cheese while you're doing it. Oh, the kids can eat some cheese while you're doing it. Just make sure you have some extra. Now can you please sprinkle some on top? We actually also like the shredded like taco blend cheese and that usually has a little bit of taco seasoning in there too. Good, Lou. So I'm gonna keep going with this and we will come back when it is time to roll. All right, so I'm just gonna start rolling. You can see that these are all done. So I just wanted to show you my process. So you kind of take this side and fold it forward and kind of start to tuck it under the meat and cheese a little bit. And then take your sides and fold them in. I always get stressed about this, which is why I'm showing. I always feel like I'm doing it wrong. And then just keep rolling it until you see your seam. Make sure your seams are all tucked nicely. And then you're gonna go seam side down on a parchment lined baking sheet. So now I'm gonna take the butter. And, and I'm gonna pour it on. We're not gonna pour it, we're gonna brush the top. So can I show exactly. you first? Yes. Okay. Yes, Mata? So. Get it on the brush. Look, swipe it like this so it's not too drippy. Uh, okay. And just no. kind of just paint the top like that, okay? It's just going to give a little more color to the top and a little more flavor. Okay. So dip it in. Brush it on the side. Okay. And then go ahead and no, paint no, the top no. of that one. It's very painting. Yep. Watch your sleeve. But different. <laughs> like painting, but different. All right, so we'll get these all done and then we're gonna put them in a 400 degree oven. Fifteen minutes later, your taco dippers will be done, and I just wanna say that you can make these ahead of time, Wrap them in plastic wrap in a Ziploc in the freezer, and then the day of your kid can just you can reheat them for them. So these are like something that you can make a bunch of and save for later. And you're just gonna serve them with whatever your child likes to dip their taco in. So what do you like to dip your tacos in? Sour cream. Sour cream. Not taco sauce. Not taco sauce. I'm your kid biggest. What about salsa? No, I have. Some kids can like uh, pick their favorite sauce to have. Like, like whatever your kid say something, like sour cream or, or, or sauce, they, they can pick whatever sauce they want to do on the plate. That's right, you can put whatever sauce you want on the plate, right? Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for watching. I hope that you make our taco dippers. Please leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Oh, 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 oh,